At this point, my heart was racing. I was excited to see something with horns that was in range. The struggle between my heart and my head was real. My heart wants me to take the shot, but my head tells me that it's a young buck that needs a few more years. We'll see which one wins. By this point, my mind has won. This deer will live to see another day. Time to sit back and enjoy the scenery, hoping for a bigger one to step out before dark. I watched that buck for over 15 minutes. He didn't have a clue I was there, or he didn't mind me being there. Either way, he seemed to go about his business as normal. No other buck stepped out this evening, but still a win when you don't get skunked. It is October 10th and Poe is in the same tripod I was hunting a few days ago where I saw that nice young eight-pointer. It is sprinkling a little bit, but it should be a good evening for Poe. Poe showing off his self-filming skills. He's a pro on an amateur show. Look who stepped out. The same deer I saw just a few days before. He sure isn't scared to show his face in the daylight. Young and dumb for sure. Let's hope he can make it to see next year.
It is always a joy to see animals in their natural habitat, especially deer hitting scrapes or chasing does come rut season. Communication at its finest right there. Poe had one other small buck step out right before dark. On to the next hunt. The Run and Gun Base by Fourth Arrow Camera Arms is perfect for that public land hunter or that hunter on a budget. The Run and Gun Base is designed to stay with you in your camera arm and shoulder so you are always prepared to capture that next memorable moment. Windsend. Never heard of it? Well, that's about to change. From the creators of Fourth Arrow, Windsend is an electronic scent vaporizer that has revolutionized the scent industry. Reasons to choose Windsend. Scent dispersal methods and vaporized scent is stronger travels farther and lasts longer than any other scent form. Get your wind scent at windscent.com.
A young doe steps out at the edge of the beans, about 40 yards. Not long after, a bigger, more mature doe steps out of the woods. Target acquired. Time to fill the freezer. This doe is staying just out of Poe's comfy zone, around 40 yards, pretty much just toying with our hearts, like most women tend to do. It's beginning to be a race against time. As every second passes, it gets darker and darker. Come here, dear. It being early season, first archery season before rifle season opens, Poe wasn't going to take a chance on a bad shot on this doe. 
She never was broadside and stood still long enough within 40 yards. Even though no meat filled the freezer, having deer in shooting range is a feeling that never gets old. Hunter Safety Systems harnesses and lifelines allow us to be safely secured from point A to point B. The quietness and usability of the lifelines make them a no-brainer. Get your lifelines and other Hunter Safety System products at huntersafetysystem.com. Trophy Rock, the all-natural, American-made deer supplement. We put out year-round to promote deer health and antler growth. We use the rock form in timber locations on a stump where it's elevated so the deer feel more comfortable and less alert. We use the 465 in a more open situation whether it be a field or a food plot. You can find these products on redmondhunt.com, Facebook, or Instagram where we choose to get them is our local Orsons. We are in the stand we call the cut. It is lightly sprinkling, but that doesn't stop us or the deer this morning. Things are starting out well with a young buck walking to within 30 yards of the stand. We love seeing babies while hunting. It shows us that they survived the hardest part of their life, that time from birth to a few months old. Early season rule here at BMO though, is if babies are still with a mama, we pass on that mature doe.
This morning had a lot of action, but no meat in the freezer or horns on the wall. Until the next one, keep on keeping on. Archery deer hunting is a challenge, from the human factor to the closeness the animal has to come to get in range. It is always best to give yourself the best chance possible. The same reasons we wear all camo are the same reasons we spray down before going to the stand, and why we run the scent crusher room clean back at our scent room. That is, to give ourselves the best chance to ethically harvest an animal. The stand we are heading to is Timmy's Corner, as previously mentioned a few times. One of the many reasons we like this stand so much is the access in and out. Using the levee as protection, walking through the tall grasses and reeds, we can enter and exit this stand without disturbing anything in the field it watches over. Watching a young buck push around a group of does, yearlings, gets the blood flowing, knowing that rut is just around the corner and that possibly that hitless buck could be giving you that shot, making that fatal mistake. Make sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and subscribe to our YouTube page to stay up to date with all things Big Money.